Hello my loves, how are we all? I hope you're all well. I'm really hoping I don't fall through. I'm sat on like an uh, ottoman in Arabella's room and I'm really hoping halfway through the video I don't just fall through. How are we all? Um, so loads of you I would have thought will come over from Instagram so you already know who I am but in case anyone doesn't I'm Paige. Um, I'm 20 six years old um i have a little girl called arabella grace she is um nearly 19 months old now and i thought i would ease myself into youtube by starting off with a haul um so i have a um instagram account called deep breath small steps which i run with my sister coral um that is all very focused on mental health and um support and advocating um for people with mental health and i also have a page called spotlessly me um which this is the youtube version of um i do cleaning videos i've got ocd um but i genuinely do love clean i'm gonna yawn i'm so sorry i'm gonna have to edit out so many yawns i yawn all the time um so yeah I have an Instagram page called Spotlessly Me, which I do lots of cleaning videos on and they're quite popular now. Um, so I wanted to bring it over to YouTube and do longer videos. Um, so this is a haul. So yesterday, me and Coral went to Home Bargains, Matalan, McDonald's. I mean, that's not, I'm not going to haul that um and the, a couple of days before i went to primark b and m is that it i think so so i got arabella i started arabella's christmas shopping and um, so i'm going to show you some bits i obviously bought cleaning stuff because you know i can't go anywhere to any shop without buying something cleaning related whether it's a cloth or a cleaning spray i'm obsessed I love cleaning um so first things first let's get started so the first thing i got this is in home bargains i got some dishwasher it's a dishwasher cleaner um it's two tablets two uses um and yeah you put one in once a month apparently helps eliminate grease lime scout and malodors so yeah, cause no one wants their dishwasher smelling at all. Then I got this. This is really good for any stains. Obviously, Arabella constantly stain it. Oh my god, you all again. I'm gonna have to edit out so many yawns. Um so yeah, I got this um stain remover, you spray it on as soon the quicker with stains, I always say because I'm really good at getting stains out but time is of the essence so even if we're out and she um gets a stain on her i'll change her and put even a bit of hand soap from like one of the bathrooms on the stain you've got to work really quick with it don't let it get into the material so yeah that's really good for if you're at home then we have my best friend barkeeper's friend um this is brilliant on sinks this is brilliant on ovens it's like a really abrasive um i mean obviously check it on your sinks i don't want anyone scratching their sink off but mine stainless steel this brings it up amazing um i always use this i think it's great you can use it on sides and that as well but uh, it's quite a god i'm so sorry i was up until like four four yesterday morning watching cleaning tiktoks um but yeah you can use and you know like if you get a real bad stain on your like um oven tray or something like that this is brilliant then this is my fa i couldn't live without the dr beckman pet stain and odor remover i don't really use it for pet stains because lila touchwood hasn't made any stains in a long time um but i do use it for if arabella spills something on the carpet um if someone walks in mud which makes me shiver the thought of it um what else do i use it for like the other day she got lots of makeup on the carpet this just brings it out amazing and if your dog does wee on the carpet this is what you want really 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 good then i got this um i love this it just makes your house smell so clean and like 
you've just done loads of washing even if you haven't um, i always spray this on my front mat so as people come in it smells really nice i always always get complimented on how nice my house smells and i've got a dog and it never ever smells a dog then I got this little beauty. Uh, okay, you want to go? Sorry. Um, this is the pink stuff spray. Um, this is brilliant. Same as elbow grease. I feel like they they sort of go hand in hand. Um, I picked up the pink spray. I'm gonna use a bit of this in the oven later because there is. I properly cleaned my oven the other day, but there is a little bit that I can't get rid of. This should do the trick. If not the paste, I've got the paste as well. So that's that then i've used some of these already sorry then i just picked up a big bundle of cleaning cloths um again you can't go wrong with microfiber cloths um i'm always washing them always you know drying them and using them and stuff so the, as many as many the better the more the merrier is what i mean so that's that so that's my little cleaning haul done i then popped into matalan um no, this ain't my Matalan bag. Well, I got these from Matalan anyway. These were reduced. You guys, if you know me, I'm always in a fluffy cider, especially at home. But I'm always in a fluffy cider, even in the winter. So um, these were reduced to £3 because I'm guessing it's... Um, oh, stop yawning, Penny. Um, I'm guessing it's because they're sort of out of season now. But, I mean, I wear them all the way through and pink fluff. You can't go wrong with it so that's them so this is home bargains haul now sorry so i got arabella this little pepper pig cup um i like to have as many of these cups in as as possible um i always fill one up in the morning with juice and then as you go up throughout the day um and yeah that's just like a little pepper one we are pepper mad in this house um or well, arabella is pepper mad so we you know we i do actually quite enjoy pepper i do think she's a bit rude sometimes but at 18 months i don't think she's taking too much of that in um but i do find pepper really cute i got this for my hair i do sometimes i know hairdressers are gonna scream at me out there but i do sometimes just put a little bit of blonde through the through the front of my hair obviously my roots are bad so um i just i really don't like sitting at hairdressers i don't enjoy it at all um sorry i'm getting dry throat i don't enjoy sitting there really um and i feel like trying to make small talk is just awkward um, i did have a lovely girl doing my hair who i would happily go back to but she's on maternity leave um so yes yeah, so my mum's a hairdresser so she sort of points me in the right direction but i do sometimes just put a bit of blonde through there so that's for that i don't recommend it but that's what i do then i got actually some christmas cards this one's for dan it says to the one i love this one says for very special grandparents. These are literally, that was 79p. If you were in Clinton's, they'd charge you about 3 99 for that. And then this one for Arabella says my daughter, um, 59p. Literally, that, that exact card would be 2 99 3 in um, Clinton's. So get to home bargains for your Christmas cards, guys. Then I got her this um, pepper pig messy mat i think that's great you can put it down we love to do arts and crafts in this house um as much as i am a bit ocd about my cleaning i'm not when it comes to arabella having fun i will happily let her do whatever and then i'll clean it up afterwards so but this is actually really good she'll love the fact that it's pepper um and yeah you spread it out do all your arts and crafts give it a wipe fold it back away your floors are safe so um that's brilliant i love that then we've started to like a bit of colouring. Um, obviously, she's only 18 months, but she loves getting pens and pencils and starting to colour. So, um, this is the first one. This is Christmas colouring. Again, what was this? 99p. And look how many there are in there. I think it's just great. Um, and then we, I actually had to get these because I saw pepper colouring books. They were 79p each. But it'll just, she'll love that. She'll absolutely love doing that. So yeah, I want to get her some nice crayons as well, but I haven't, I couldn't see any in there. Um, so I did get these. Obviously, don't leave them un, um, what's the word? Unsupervised with these. Um, but as long as you're there, 
keeping a close eye some felt tip pens there for her and i did also again supervise um but i did get some pencils as well there so oh here's the rest of my matland haul so i got arabella how cute are these these little unicorn slippers um they were five pounds and i just think they'll keep her little feet warm and they're actually really like sturdy as well so she's not going to be slipping everywhere in them then i got her this which i just think is adorable she's in size 18 to 24 months now how cute is that though Minnie mouse um that was eight pound little dress didn't come with any tights or anything which if you go to primark and you buy a dress like that you'd get the tights to match in with it but didn't come with anything but she has got loads of tights then i got her this for christmas um christmas time this probably won't be what she wears on actual christmas day but yeah we've got a pe little peppa pig dress uh, that's 18 to 23 months 23 18 to 23 months i'm sure most shops do 18 to 24 months um but that was like i think that was about eight pounds as well Matalan's not as cheap as Primark, definitely not. Um, oh, I love this though. How cute is this? Little jumper. And it says little star on it. And that was £7. But again, in Primark, you'd get trousers with that for £7, definitely. But that was adorable, so I had to get it. It needs an iron. I have to iron it before she wears it. Um, so that was that bag. Then when I popped to Primark the other day... Oh, my sister bought her this. How cute is this? Little backpack with the reins. I think she got it in boots. With the little reins. So how cute is that? I love, I love little backpacks. Like I could just put a little snack in there. She could never even, even have a little nappy and a pack of wipes. And you don't need to carry anything else. Um, little, or little snacks in there. That is so cute. So yeah, I'm pretty sure that was from boots. Um, and then very boring i popped in and got myself some socks because my socks just literally disappeared these are like sparkly um so they were five pound five five pound five pairs for three pound then i mean is it even winter if you haven't got a pair of the fluffy leggings from primark they have gone up in price so they're seven pound i'm sure they used to be about fiver but yeah they're really cute i love them they'll, they'll be so warm also got myself some tights because um last year when i cleaned out all my or this year when i cleaned out all my drawers i just threw all my tights away because they were all in a bundle and they annoyed me so i've got a fresh set of tights and then finally in primark i just got myself some of these hair clips sparkly because when i do my hair all curly i do put like a like two of the clips there to give it like a bit of what's the word lift there do you know what i mean I'll stick them clips, one there, one there, and it just lifts it up while it's sort of setting, and then I'll take them out. So that's that. I think that's everything I got in Primark. And then just a couple of little bits in B&M. Um, like I say, I'm definitely not done with Christmas shopping, but I did pick up a few bits. First thing I got was this. This was £5. It's nothing. Um, a little dog, the little water bowl the cage and it, in it it's got some little scissors and a comb what else is in there there's another little instrument i don't know what's in there but how cute is that she'll love it because she's got a little a li even smaller sorry my shoulder section she's got an even smaller crate than this and a little white um rabbit cat thing that goes in it and she's obsessed with putting it in and out so she'll love that that was in B&M. B&M have got really good deals on at their toys at the minute. Uh, we also, me and Coral, got um, Arabella and Finley, my little nephew, these. Because they're just cute. They'll like um, rolling them. Um, so one's for Arabella, one's for Finley. Uh, they were only £3 each. But yeah, they'll love that. Um, oh, and I got her one of these balls. How'd you do it? Another... Lila's got a backup. So how cool is that? I used to have one of these when I was little. Um, so I got her that. That was six ninety nine. It's like a sensory ball. Um, so she'll like that. Then my sister actually got her some books. She got her Listen Up Pup. 
she got her just me and you just you and me you're right Layla. it's okay it's finished now um super sid the silly sausage dog and the short-sighted giraffe so there's some little books for her we do love our reading especially at bedtime and then i got this for her bath because we're all about bath time toys um it's the shark grabber you like put the fish in the bath and then this you you grab the fish with the, the little handle so she'll like that and then just lastly oh i got i haven't fallen through the ottoman yet in um home bargains i got this i don't know how much it was It might have been, I think it was like 4 or something. But how lovely is that? They had ones with bees on as well, but I'm all about the butterflies. Um, I think that's lovely. It smells like... What does it smell like? A bit like men's aftershave. But I got it for the look, not the smell. I probably won't burn it. So that will go in my bathroom. And I think that is my haul. Um... So yeah, it's got started a little bit on the Christmas shopping. Um, oh, sorry. Um, let me know what you guys are getting, your little ones for Christmas, because I am looking for ideas. I do want to get her a little slide that she can have inside or outside. Um, I've seen them online, but I'm sort of stumped as to, toys-wise, what to get her, um, because she's got so many toys. And... Um, most of the things i've seen she's got so yeah give me some ideas comment down below if you like this video please let me know um please subscribe i'm going to be doing loads of cleaning videos um motherhood anything you want to see as well just pop down below and i will get onto it um but yeah thank you so much for watching if you made it this far um any comments like i say are really really appreciated please like it, please subscribe, please come back. Um, and yeah, thank you so much for watching and thank you for supporting me. Um, and yeah, any questions as well, leave them down below and I'll answer them. Thank you, bye.